Hey guys, McJeffries here, and welcome to a brand new series called McJeffries Plays Train Fever. Um, this is a game that I saw um, videos of on YouTube. People had made beta test videos of it, and it looked really, really cool. Um, for those of you who aren't aware of this game, I know it looks a little bit niche to some of you, uh, and you know, to be honest, it is. But this game is heavily influenced by Transport Tycoon, Railroad Tycoon, Open TTD, and marginally by Cities in Motion. And if you just look at the quality of these graphics, you'll see why. It's a little bit laggy at the moment because it had to do a, a texture test and things when it first started up. I mean, if you look at this, you see people... Wow, it is really laggy at the moment. You see people here like this guy walking around and you can get really, really close when you zoom in. And it's got all these little individual towns which all have names, which is fantastic. Really cool to see. Again, a little bit with the lag. Uh, I managed to make the camera move just now to do that. Oh, there we go. And it's got English names as well, like Skelm Skelmersdale. I picked a really bad example. Shepton Mallet. And um, other places which I can't see right now. This is a huge world as well. If I zoom out as far as I can, once we sort the... I think that is as far out as I can go actually. But it is massive. I promise you it is massive. Anyway, the game wants us to do this little tutorial thing. Um, I'm probably going to do this. This is literally the first time I've played this game. I downloaded it this morning and this is the first time I've actually started it up and tried to do something with it. So it's probably advisable that I, uh, I follow the tutorial. So let's set up a bus line first of all. Um... Oh, it's not actually helping us. Okay, let me move this over here. I thought it would be like, click this, do this. Uh, let's do it for Skelmersdale, shall we? Actually, I want to see if there's another nearby. So Skelmersdale there. I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. There's Saxmundham. Again, hope I'm pronouncing that right. That's here. That's not an English name. Aspatria, that is not an English name. And we've got Heathfield over here, which is actually just very close to the name of the town that I'm from. Uh, we've got Lydney, which is in Gloucestershire. This game is still struggling a little bit to get the uh, the old lag out of the way. You can see all these little farmer's fields as well. They'll come into play a little bit later. Oh, where? That's only about 20 minutes away from where I live. That's kind of cool. Didcot. Uh, we found the edge of the map as well. This is where we get an idea of just how big this map is. I'm going to try and find a really cool place to start. Eastley on the south coast of England. Got a few hills. Cows, which is on the Isle of Wight. Totten and Ealing. Elling. Todmorden. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to build a bus line in Todmorden, I think. Have a nice little line start up here. Right, so I have to go to the roads option, which is there. I have to move these over again a little bit. Uh, like that. That's tram tracks. We want streets or stations. That's what we want. Click on the stations button in the sub menu. Oh, Christ. Right, let me move this over to this side. Like so. Select the bus slash tram stop, which I assume is that one. Hold the mouse over a sidewalk and place. Um, just trying to think where would be a good spot to do this. I think just a simple loop around here would be cool. So let's have. Uh, I'm trying to get the mouse in a decent place. Let's have one there. Oh wait, what side of the road are we on? What side of the road are we moving on at the moment? Or does that come afterwards? That might come afterwards. Screw it. I'll put one there. Oh, first bus stop. Um, we'll have one there. One here 
another one here and one in this gap there and a final one there okay let's close that next first line click on the lines button which is this one is it this one what's that landscaping oh I didn't know you could do that uh, on the right hand side bottom most the line manager opens yes that's what we want click on the bus stations in the order you want them to be added to the line I suppose we'll start with this one no don't want that we want the stop Have I missed something oh I missed the new line button doi new line there we go now we can do this so it goes there. Main Street. Have these stops all got names? That is so cool. Windsor Road. The Drive. Oh wow. Each of these little High Street. Each. Oh. Did that one work? Park Road, yeah. And Mill Road. You're happy with the line? Click on the Add Station button again. Uh, wait, where's it gone? Deactivates the Add Station mode. If not, you can remove stations by selecting them in the list and clicking on the Remove button and then Add Stations again afterwards. Okay, so I'm happy with that. Next. Build a road depot. Well, let's build one... I was about to say out of town, but I think that's a little... I just really like how these stops all have names. Look, Main Street, Windsor Road, The Drive, High Street, Park Road, Mill Road. That is so cool. Does that mean all of these streets have names as well? That would be so awesome if that's true. Is that something being built? New house being built? That is fantastic. Right, build a road depot. I know how to do that. That's a road depot. That's a tram depot. So we'll do a road depot. And we'll pop it bit of lag again. Um, let's just put it there for now. Right, click on the depot in the sub menu, fourth from top. Oh wait, have I done that? Yes. Place the depot by pointing into a street. There we go. Right. First bus, click on the depot you want to build in the last step. Note that a window opens. That's this one. Click on the buy road vehicles, uh, select a bus and click buy. Well, that would have to be this one. Um, oh, lag again. There we go. We'll get a few of these going. Two. Let's do four of these to start with. So one, two, three, four. Uh, in the depot, click on select line all and choose the line. Line 1. There we go. They should. Yeah, they're all moving. Awesome. Okay. In that case, I can now close that, close that, close that, and close that. Um. Close that, I guess. Close that. And close that. Right, now let's set up a railway line. And I know we're already where it's going to go. It's going to go from Todd Morden over to, I think, Eastley. Oh, the first passenger is waiting at the drive. Where's the drive? Ah, was it over here? Looks like it. It had a little symbol come up. First bus has arrived at the drive. Uh, has got passengers one of five. So at the moment we're limited to one passenger. Uh, not one pa five passengers, sorry. Uh, it's, oh, that window closed itself, which is cool. We've got passengers waiting here. We've got one. We've got one there, one there, one there. I assume one yellow man means one passenger waiting. And 
say two yellow man men mean two passengers waiting. I think that's the way it works. Let's set up a railway line anyway. Okay, before you start, choose the two towns you want to connect. The distance between the two towns shouldn't be too large. The towns should take should be about on the same level, preferably near a river or lake. Why do they have to be near a river or lake? Ah, we're not near a river or a lake. Okay, build two train stations. That's station. Lag again. Just look for the lag. There we go. Now, place the station by pointing to an existing street or by pointing to empty land and using M or N to rotate. Now I can see this being quite a busy station, so we want I'd say three tracks to start with. Uh, and I might just pop it. Okay, this is train collision. In that case, we'll pop it in this gap. Um, click if ready to build. Actually, do you know what? I'm going to go four tracks. And I'm also going to make it a little bit longer. It's going to go overkill on this first station. Like that. So that's now built. I'm going to connect it to the road network using um, we we'll use a small street for now. Oops, have to click and drag on this game. There we go. Collision. Do I have to delete these? Looks like I do. Okay, try again. There we go. Confirm. Built. Awesome. Now I've got to go and build the uh, station at the other end. It's only going to be a two-track job. Where is... Where's it gone? Easily. There it is. Um, this one is going to be built slightly out of town up here. Uh, we'll go for the shorter platform length as well. It's going to be... I'll say like that. And then again, we're going to have to connect this up. Let's delete... Uh, that building. We'll have to connect it up like this. That'll do for now. Okie cokie. Next. Connect two stations. Click on the tracks button, which is this. Um, right side topmost. Clicked on the tracks button in the sub menu. Track building mode is now activated. Hold the mouse over the endpoint of a track such that the circle turns blue. Drag and the mouse to plan a track segment, then release. If satisfied with the current track, click the green check mark. Repeat these steps until the two stations are connected. OK. Now, those red circles you can see coming up, they are speed limits. So at the moment, you can see the train will be going at 120. I assume this is kilometers per hour as it crosses this road and starts heading up this hill. Uh, I was happy with that, but I'm just thinking actually, because where's... I think it might be cheaper. Oh, I don't know. Now I've done that. That's, yeah. Right, we're going to cross this over... ...here. Like that. So now we're over the other side of the road, we can start worrying a little bit more about keeping it as flat as possible, which has failed already because I've started building a tunnel which I didn't actually want to build, but there you go. Um, this is turning out to be quite an expensive railway. Wow, is there a way to take out loans on this game? I can fix the slope, I can make it go down, or I can make it go up, but I can't make it go up any higher than that. Hmm. I might have messed this up a little bit. Let me see if there's a way of taking out a loan. There is. I can borrow money. Uh, I think that's a million I've just borrowed. Let's take it up to 
two million. There we go. Right, where did this come up to? There. The goal now is to connect this as quick as is humanly possible. Right. Uh, if I come down this way a little bit, we should be on flatter ground. God, there's so many tunnels. This is really expensive. At least now we're on the flat. Oh, he says, whilst this train is going into another tunnel. Oh my goodness, this is expensive. How far away is... Oh, we're nearly there. At least. How much do we need to connect this up? We need... Is that 1.5 million I saw? 9 million did that say? Oh no, 1.58. a lot of money. We're borrowing a lot of money here. Right, slope is too high. Something's not right there. So let's build that to there and confirm that. It's in another sodding tunnel. What the heck is going on? We need this to slope down. No. Um delete that bit. This is stressful. This is stressful. We need this to slope down. At the moment that's going up. We don't want it to go up. We want it to come down to ground level. This is turning into an incredibly expensive build. Let's take another option. Let's start from this end and work it round like this. That's that's quite a curve. We've got going there, and this is also quite a curve. It's all in tunnel again. I've picked two bad stations to be doing this. This is terrible. I might have to start again at this rate, you know. Alright, saying not enough space. Not enough space to do what? <clears throat> Alright, I can lift that up. Like that. And then that should make this bit a little bit easier to build. What does it say there? Slope too high. Yeah. Thought it might. Right, let's delete that. And then let's delete this bridge here. It's not too expensive actually to do that. Now let's see if I can connect these up. From here all the way over to here. Slope too high again. Really? How bad is it? Where is the slope even? I think it's this bridge. Oh wait, that bridge already... Yeah. It's... This tunnel, I think, which is causing problems now. Uh, let's lift that up. Go down here. Oh, that's not even connected. Oh god, I hope I haven't done that anywhere else. That would be embarrassing. Right, so I've got 2.6 million pounds. It says dollars, but I'm going to call it pounds. Let's connect this up. It said there, terrain alignment collision. Okay. I need 2.28 million, so a couple more of these. And we're done. Okay, we're done. We've built our first railway. Which currently links up this station here with... Oh, that's a, such a long tunnel. I'm going to regret that so much. 
Anyway, it comes out the tunnel there, goes over a bridge there, through that tunnel, through that tunnel. Which again, I'm probably going to regret. Uh, down that way, through that tunnel. My keyboard's messing me around again. Out of there, over this road, and into this station here. Right, now I've got to build the sodding depot. Which end can I build the depot at? This end, perhaps? Although, now I've said that... Oh, actually, this could work. We have this big thing that we already had. I like the way I'm using my English to my full capabilities right now. Um, Alright, here's Eastley. I suppose the depot could come off. That's dreadful. Come off this way. Like that. And then have another line that comes off. Terrain alignment collision. Hmm. Can I build it like this? It's still saying terrain. Ah, oh, there you go. I can build it like that. Okay. Let's build our depot. Lag again. So that has to go there. Or it can go there. Or I can extend this down like that. Bring that one in and try and connect it up. Doesn't want to play ball right now. Does not want to play ball. So I can do that. And then see if I can get that to connect up. No? What about this? Close. Very close. Why is that not working? I can't even get it to run alongside. Oh, hang on. Aha! Yes. I'll make this a little bit straighter. Like that. I might be able to get this to run. Oh, so close. That's, that's absolutely fine. I can fix this. I can make this work. I've used up literally all of my money doing this like that and then if I make this just a fraction longer this one should be able to link up to that one oh right depot done okay set up the line so we have to go into this again um, new line. Uh, station's already done, so it's going to go from Eastley to Todd Morden. Like so. Uh, that's actually making us money, that line. So that's good. Right. Click on the first, then on the second, click on the add station button again to deactivate. First train. Oh god. We're totally bankrupt right now. Let's uh, get some more money. Then we've got to click on the depot. We've got to buy a train. I guess we'll be buying this. Uh, select a locomotive in the list and click buy. How much is this? 201k? Oh my god. Okay. Uh, select a wagon and click buy. Let's get four wagons to start with. Like that. Close the buy trains window. In the depot window, click set line. Line 2. Bit of lag again. 
Come on, there we go. Right, the train is going. It can hold 24 passengers. I really hope we get 24 passengers. Train starts moving. So we'll close that. We'll close that. And now I guess we'll close that. Is there a way that I can get the camera to follow this? Is it that one? Yeah, there we go. Okay, now we need passengers. I'm not sure how many passengers we'll get to start with. Uh, close that window as well. Right, guys. Well, we've had an adventurous start, I think is the nice way of saying it. We have built our first bus line, which looks financially successful. This is our first railway line, which is not so financially successful at this moment in time. That should, however, change once this train starts running a few times. Um, we should start making some money because we have a huge debt that we need to pay off. Nobody on board. Is anybody waiting at the other platform? We don't really know right now, do we? This is so bad. I can't believe I let myself build this railway line with all these tunnels and stuff. This is stupid. How is our finances doing? Oh man, loan interest, 77k. Yikes. Um, where's income? Income, there we go, road. Yeah, we're getting money from the road, so that's alright. This train isn't going very fast. I was hoping it would run a little bit faster than this. Wow, okay. It might speed up as it starts going up and downhill, whatever. Okay guys, I'm going to end this episode here because we've gone on for nearly half an hour now. So this is like a first look episode. Um, it's like uh, what you guys think of this game kind of thing. I'd like to do a series on this. Um, obviously, you guys have your input. If you don't think this is a good idea, then let me know. But I think this will be a good good one, good fun. It's a bit like Cities in Motion, which does well on my channel, so uh, I can't see why it wouldn't be very popular. Anyway, guys, I am going to end this episode here now. So, thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, be sure to click the subscribe button. If you have already subscribed to my channel, thank you guys for your continued support. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. And until next time, I will see you soon.